There we go. Got him. First fish of the day. Feels like a very tiny copy of that. Got him. Got him fish. I don't know what I'm talking about. Alright. I am using a Bobby Garland and I can't remember the color. I think it's just called Chartreuse and Red. Looks like tomato colored with a chartreuse bottom, a little white crop. Alright, okay. Take them. Like I said, I'm happy to get anything. There we go. Oh, I got a nice one, guys, whatever this is. Oh, yeah. All right. Nice crappie for here. I'm telling you. Oh, yeah. It's about as big as they get in here. He's not bad at all. All right, guys, today is February the 27th. I have not fished for seven weeks. You heard that right, seven weeks. We actually had what I call a 10 year winter down here in Southern Missouri, but it was the worst winter we've had in 30 years as far as temperature wise. We had we didn't have much snow or ice or none of that. It really wasn't the accumulation that made it a bad winter. It was just the temperatures. When it don't get above 25 degrees for a high, I'm not getting out. When it's 37, 38, it does not bother me at all. In fact, half time I don't even wear a coat. I'll just wear a long sleeve shirt. But for some reason, when it's that cold, there was just nothing you could do. It was just a really, really rough winter down here. Today is a full moon of February. When that happens, generally speaking, that is when the walleye spawn in this section of the state is the last week of February, especially on a full moon. The river is about two foot high, but it is still clear. It's kind of an off grayish green color. Uh, I'm targeting sauger and walleye. And then if they don't bite, I have that one tree I always catch crappie on toward the end of the trip. And uh, so I got a chance at some crappie and then there's always a chance at spotted bass, of course. The only good thing about the river being this high, I don't have to worry about hitting stuff. A little less chance of hitting anything. Uh, it's complete overcast day. 50 degrees throughout the entire day and like I said a full moon so stay with me hopefully my first video in, the, in two months will be a good one I'm up. All right, guys, got one. Yes, haven't even been fishing five minutes, man. Sweet, it's big too, whatever this is. Oh my God, what do I got? I got, I'm using a Berkeley Power Grub. It's purple and chartreuse. This is a big fish, guys. Oh my, oh my God, goodness. Oh my goodness. Whoa, whoa, it's a big buffalo. Wow, holy crap. Oh my God. 
Wow, I've already had a good day as long as I can get him. Oh, what very unexpected catch, guys. Very unexpected. It's a smallmouth buffalo. That is freaking awesome. He's about seven or eight pounds, man. No, he's about 10 pounds. Whoa, he's going nuts now. Oh my goodness. That is so cool that I caught him. I thought it was a big walleye. It's a little disappointment, but not really. I mean, that is just cool. <laughs> oh my. I would have never thought in a million years I'd get one of these today, not in the winter time like this. Oh, he got off, man. Shit. I was gonna keep him. Damn, man. Shit. Well, we got to see it anyway. <laughs> There we go. Yes. What do I got this time? Now this is a real fish and it's not a buffalo. All right. I got a bass. Hey, it's a fish. It is, I can tell that full moon bites on, guys. All right. I'll take him. Not bad. I caught him on a four inch yellow curly tail with a Callens half ounce googly eye jig head. Google eye or goggle eye jig head. I think it's googly eye. Not bad. Now I'm getting back to where I want to be. I got a crappie, nice little white crappie, on the tomato and chartreuse Bobby Garland. Oh yeah, he's a keeper, for sure, he is a keeper. Exactly five foot down, and there's a log down here, but I cannot see it, but it's there every year. It's about two foot high, so I can't get a. I'm just taking a gamble getting hung. Nice little. He's about 11, almost 12 inches on the tomato and chartreuse Bobby Garland. Not bad. I'll take him all day.
go. All right, yeah. Nice white cut. Oh my. <sighs> yes. Another nice 12 inch white cut, you guys. What a beauty. He's got some backbone too. He might be 13. This time I switched colors because I got hung. I got this guy on the orange green sickle, Bobby Darwin. And he's a nice one. Oh my. Take those all day. 